everybody, go back to another video. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to make a super cool magnet powered hover bike. Wow. Plus, it's super easy to make. All right, let's get started. Okay, so we're gonna start by placing down about three wooden rods upwards. So just do that. And we're gonna be using mostly purely titanium rods for this just to get the whole body outline like this. And then you wanna go one, two, and then over here, one, two. Then you can place a rod like this, and then one rod over here, and then just place it backwards like this. Pretty much the same thing for the front and the back is gonna be mimicked. So now say you rotate to 15, rotate it twice like this. You're gonna go one, two, three, and then you're gonna go one, two, three, and then you go back here, you go one, two, three, and then one, two, three. Grab some titanium, place it in between here, and just set your scale to, to zero. And you're just gonna make a quick little block like this and extend it backwards here like that. Just extend it a little bit more outwards like this. Okay, perfect. You're gonna do the same thing for back here. If you want, you can literally just copy it with your child tool if you have one. If not, you can just simply just rebuild it. It's nothing too complicated. So now we're gonna grab some more titanium rods. You're gonna place two here and then two over here. Now you can grab a couple of wooden rods. You're gonna go upwards by three, so one, two, three. Grab a titanium block, place it right here. Now you wanna grab two of the old wheels, put one facing this way, and then one over here, like this. Now you wanna grab three magnet blocks, place one magnet block in the front, and then two in the back. Grab some more titanium rods, and place one here like this, and then one here like, wait, one here like this, and then like this. So you want it to look something like this, all right? Once you got this body shape down, grab some plastic. Make sure your skill tool is set to zero for this, because there's gonna be a lot of slight details we're gonna have to do. So we're gonna just outline everything, or just cover everything up with a plastic uh, cover. Say you rotate to 15, you're gonna go one, two, and he's gonna scale in a quick little design. This is gonna make it look a lot more futuristic in my opinion. I don't know, I just really like how this looks, so we're gonna do this. So make a quick thing here in the front. And then have it kind of poke out here. You can adjust it a bit more. Remember, it's all adjustable, so you can design this however you want. This is just how I designed it, because I thought it looked pretty cool. So we're gonna go like this. And just stretch it out here like this. All right, so now you're gonna put a block here. For this, you want to turn on mass rotation to make this easier. And we're just going to cover the pole. So just like this. And just get a decent outline. You do not need the trial tool for this. But if you do, it will make your life 10 times easier. So I'm going to use the trial tool. In that case, you can literally just copy all of this to the back. So just select everything. And just copy it if you can. If you do have the trial tool. If not, you can just do the same steps again. Just do like that. And deselect, reselect. Turn it over. Get the front here. Place the block here. Just cover it up with plastic. So it's pretty much going to be a bunch of blocks or blocky types. So go like this. we are going to create a block here. Make sure these two are sticking out. Place another plastic block. Scale it into itself. There you go. It's going to be like a little box in the front. Kind of like the more corners and stuff it has, the more futuristic it'll look. So it looks like it's like a bunch of more components. So just do this, extend this backwards, place the block here. So now the rest of this entire thing is just you kind of outlining it the way you want. It's kind of like its own body kit if you think of it in a sort of way. So just kind of build your way around it. Build a box, build a boat, build a hover car. So place a block here. As you can tell, I'm not just making a box like this because then it would make it look a little bit too ugly. It would look like it's uh, just super uncanny, right? So what I recommend is just covering each thing the way you want it. So remember, have some creativity when you're building this. Creativity? Yeah. Creativity when you're building this. You're outlining it to make it look super cool. Think of it as like a drawing, right? You're adding little details to each little part. Each little part could be its own thing, you know? So just kind of outline it. Or like I'm going to do, just trial tool it so it could be easier for you. See, it, it, that already makes it look 10 times cooler. Look at it. This could be like, I don't know, but looks already cooler. So just do that for every single part. And just kind of outline it. There's, there's not really much to this build except just outlining what you want and, you know, making it look like the way you want to. Again, same thing as in the front. 
Another block here to cover up all the titanium. And just shoop. And then downwards. If you see any titanium sticking out, you can easily just fix it by just kind of making the block a little bit better. So there you go. Slight adjustments, as you can tell. Pretty much all the titanium is covered up. So I'm just going to finish this up here. Now you just want to grab a pilot seat. Place it around top of here. Unbind it from the wheels. So just unbind that. Alright, so now to make the little effect. Oh, gotta got to adjust this. You know, everything needs its little adjustments. To make the little blue effect in the bottom, all you really have to do is just place a block here. Like this. Scale it into itself. Depending on the height. Grab a neon block. Make sure right here. Make it really thin. And just kind of get the size of it. Show just like this. And just, just color it blue, you know. Nothing complicated. And you can literally just copy it over here in the back. Yep. Oh, ah. A little adjustment. You see, that's simple. Really simple. It's nothing complicated when building, like, something like this. All right, so now you just want to color everything. I prefer the color white just because it looks a lot cooler. But if you want, you can do something like this. As you can tell, something like this also looks pretty cool. But I like the color white a little bit better because it looks more futuristic. So I'm just going to... Okay, you got to admit, that looks pretty cool. All right, so a quick adjustment we're going to do to the wheels. You want to turn up the torque all the way so they don't actually start spinning. So now just select here. Select the rods. Add, turn it invisible. Make sure you save. Now just delete the one of rods. Select everything. Turn off anchor mode. Take your seat, click F to activate, and now you have yourself a pretty awesome looking hover bike. I mean, look at this. Just You can go downwards, you can go upwards, you can go to the right, you can go to the left. I mean, there's not much I can really you know do to show you, but it's pretty smooth. I mean, you can literally just kind of hover. Oh, 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 you see, kind of just hovering on the air. You got to admit, this looks pretty sick. You can even do a cool trick, you know, and oh, barrel. Yeah, that's how you can make a pretty simple, pretty cool... Ow! Oh, actually, smack the tree. You can turn it off, but you'll kind of get launched because magnets are like that. But yeah, that's how you can make a super cool hover bike. Hold on. Let me see if I can fly off again. Fly. Fly. I'm flying. Heck yeah. You can also be a pretty gold, gold grinder if you think about it because you can just kind of like... You can just fly to the end if you want. I mean... I don't want to. I don't want to. No, no, no. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's how you can make a super cool cover bike. If you did enjoy this video, you did find it helpful, please consider dropping a like, subscribing, turning on post notifications. Peace out, everybody.